Hi and welcome to a new video. In this video I'm doing a review of this desktop wireless adapter. Um, so as you've seen in previous videos I've done the uh, Intel wireless adapters uh, for the Wi-Fi 6 and then Wi-Fi 6E. So they normally the Intel chipsets normally are the uh, the best ones kind of out there for compatibility and normally the first to come out with a PCIe card or as you normally these are actually just adapters that are taking the uh, PCI Express kind of small cards um, and then putting it into a PCIe uh, adapter um, as, you, as you will see in a minute. So as you can see here it basically comes in a plain brown box. I got this from AliExpress. I think I paid around uh, £25 uh, and I paid uh, um, through their, their service and everything else and it got delivered with it quite quickly as well in about I think about 10 days so I was quite impressed with that. Uh, I would link to the actual product but the product page has disappeared now. So this actually adapter is an e Intel BE200 uh, so it's using the AX210 uh, chipset from Intel so that means it's for the new Wi-Fi 7 um, so as you might have seen in my community post, um, Wi-Fi 7, I've just got the uh, Asus new Wi-Fi 7 router. Um, it was uh, presented, um, I think, with Asus back uh, last year in January or February's uh, CES uh, technology show. Um, so I just got that um, last month. So I'll be doing a review on that and some speed tests. And uh, of course, I needed the... Uh, an actual device, I don't actually have any Wi-Fi 7 devices so this is uh, one of the adapters why I get and plug it into my PC. As you can see here the instructions are fairly straightforward. It's basically just telling you um, about what's included in the box. So you, of course you've got your PCI Express card, your Wi-Fi. So it does include Bluetooth as well um, and the Bluetooth um, is I believe 5.2 um, Bluetooth. Um, so again, this is the Wi-Fi 7 chipset and it includes um, the cable you need to plug into a spare USB header on your motherboard for the uh, Bluetooth and then two antennas. But as you'll see on my one, um, I opted to go for just the one an antenna and they said that was Wi-Fi 7 compatible. Um, so um, that's why my antenna is a bit different. It just got some clear instructions and it's, it's quite straightforward to be honest. Uh, around the Bluetooth cable and plugging it into a computer and then into the actual board. So to be honest, a lot of these don't even have this uh, instruction bit here about the Bluetooth. So it's good to see that they're including there. And as you can see here, it's just got literally, I think around four steps to actually, or even three, um, about having to plug it in um, into your PC, um, as you can see here. And then uh, actually just putting the antennas, as you can see here, um, basically into the back once it's installed onto your computer. Um, as it does note as well, the drivers and everything else, you'd, you're best to probably get through Windows 11. Um, and then also you're going to have um, on here as well, you probably best to go to Intel's uh, website. So he said, I got this from AliExpress. So the box it came in, it was this plain brown box, but um, it's uh, quite clear and everything else. I'll put that to one side. So again, as we said, it comes with this uh, Bluetooth cable, so that plugs in on there. So you've got your screws and everything else. As you can see here, that goes into your header, this big black one, and that one goes into the top of the PCI Express card. So it's good, it comes with everything. And for £25 for a Wi-Fi 7 uh, device and everything else is not too bad. So we'll move to the card, um, so you can see, uh, have a look at this one. So again, as we said, it's basically they're using a PCI Express adapter um, uh, for well, like these mini PCI um, basically little cards. So these are ones that normally go into your laptop. But some motherboard, big uh, PC motherboards have these as well. Um, so you can see on here as well. So it's using the chipset from Intel, as it says here, for the uh, BE200. And it's got Bluetooth, so it's got the antennas here. So it's good, it's actually good quality. It doesn't feel uh, cheap. The PCB, like the board here, uh, is sturdy and the connections are actually reinforced here, keep them down as well. And uh, it does look generally uh, quite good quality compared to some of the others I've received and everything else. So that's uh, good to see um, uh, included. 
then we just quickly have a look at the antenna. As I said, um, it normally comes with a, a dual antenna, but um, as this is Wi-Fi 7, I wanted to test out their one on their product page that said this is Wi-Fi 7. Um, I don't actually know. We'll soon when we do the testing uh, if it really is Wi-Fi 7 compatible. It's got a nice kind of silicone uh, rubber um, base here to so stop it slipping. And you can see here they've just basically wrapped up the... Uh, the actual connections and these connections will just plug into the back so oh, and again they're nice and strong so you can see here as well um, they are basically they'll just screw into onto here so you can see here um, of course you just put that on properly but you have to install the card first and then they'll go onto here so and you can actually install them so that's quite good as well so yeah so um, i'm going to be using this to test i'll be putting this into my uh, windows 11 um for and then testing this wi-fi 7 and using the uh, asus router that i've got as well i'll be a, a reviewing and unboxing later on in future videos so this is just a quick unboxing as you can see of this the new latest wi-fi 7 uh, pci express card um, again, um, the link from the product I actually bought um, it from has disappeared, but I'll put the description in there so you know what to search for. Um, and as I said, the quality, just look out to make sure that it does have um, Wi-Fi 7, because I saw some that had pictures uh, saying Wi-Fi 7 and it actually wasn't as well. So this just uh, just be, I'll give you the actual description of the chipset just to make sure you, if you are going by AliExpress or there's some probably on eBay as well you can get that may be a little bit more uh, money, but you might be able to have the uh, e-buyer protection as well. So as you can see here, the, as I said, the quality and everything else, and it did come rather quick as well. I'm 25 British pounds as well. I can't moan at all, to be honest, um, for this. So uh, this has been a, just a quick uh, uh, review and unboxing of the uh, Wi-Fi 7 adapter. Um, and again, as we're doing, using this for speed tests, and I'll probably do a video later on um, just to go through the installation as well. If I have any issues with the drivers or anything, I'll put the uh, I'll pin some comments um, under the video. All right, thank you very much for watching, and hope that you found this useful. And have a great day.